Alright guys, I've been waiting for this one for a long time, and from the looks of the title of this video, this Chromebook almost needs no introduction. It is one of the most anticipated Chromebook and Android devices ever to come out within recent. So definitely stick around and uh, check out this unboxing. So with blade in hand and an anxious heart, we'll kick this off by slicing off the sticker that stands between us. And upon opening the box, we are greeted to what looks to be uh, some instruction manuals and manufacturer warranty. And what's trapped inside also appears to be a removal tool for the pen tips for the S Pen, along with some extra tips too. Pretty nice. Trapped below, of course, is a crown jewel wrapped in plastic and squished between uh, some styrofoam. As we put the Chromebook aside, we uh, dive right into the box that's laying right next to it. This is obviously the power cord. And this is a direct USB-C to power AC. Also attached is like a Velcro cord management thing. Uh, really nice addition. I really do like that. Now for the Chromebook itself as we slide it out of the plastic here. Um, my first impressions are it is pretty light. Um, and it's very cold to the touch obviously with the all metal build. And as we open it up here, we are greeted to a 12.3 inch screen with a 3 by 2 aspect ratio, which was popularized by the Surface Pro series. Also around the back here, we get a piece of plastic that's holding both sides together. And I also fold it up here to put it to tablet mode. And I gotta admit, in tablet mode, uh, the screen and aspect ratio makes a whole lot of sense, especially for productivity and visibility. And as I flip it over here, Created to a sticker down here listing all the specs and definitely uh, pause the video for a closer look. And as I'm checking out the key travel over here on the keyboard, uh, everything feels pretty good and definitely feels more than one millimeter of travel. And as we look at the port selection here, uh, it's very forward thinking. I like the dual USB-C on each side. Of course, headset jack is here and micro SD expansion. Definitely love that. And uh, on this right side here, we got the power button and the volume rockers. And of course, here is the S Pen. And it feels very familiar to the Note 5 and Note 7's uh, S Pen. I know Samsung did not want to address this as the S Pen for their Chromebook Plus, but I'm going to call it that anyways. And yes, I even attempted to push the S Pen in the other way, and it just wouldn't go in. So, good job with that Samsung. Definite thumbs up. And of course, what good is an unboxing video without powering up the device? And in this case, it just didn't power up. Not enough charge, and it's probably best to end the video right here. Um, we'll follow up with a video review, and also do uh, some gaming tests. Of course, with the Android integration with this Chromebook, yeah, I think we got a bright future ahead. So stay tuned, guys.